Back on track, here we get it running back. Look how this fire design came out. Your boy's back on the tool. What? Stop it. Yo, I'm gonna tell you this right now. Your boy coming back, but he coming back with barber tutorials. No more gaming tutorials. People grow out of that. I'll probably come back to that in the future. But right now we focus on these haircuts. Yo. I'm gonna tell you this right now. First, first, first of all, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, because we're coming on with daily content. But let me get right to this tutorial, because we already started. Here we go. You got knocked down with the two guard. This purpose of this tutorial is to show you a design. You ever done a design? You ever drew a star? We're gonna draw. We're gonna draw a complex star. But it's gonna be one of the easiest stars. The way I'm gonna lay it out to you is ridiculous. Listen, you ever drew a star in school and you know how to connect the dots with the star? Well, listen, that's all I'm doing right here. After you connect the stars, all you gotta do is erase, erase the access here in it. Or you know how you fill in a star, like when you was in school and you fill it in with a pen or whatever? That's basically what we're doing. The first star came out a little sloppy, but we're gonna get it right to it with the second star. Look at the second star. It's gonna look a little bit more symmetrical. The, the ideology of a star is making a star as sharp as possible making the corners as sharp as possible right now this template right here looks crazy but watch when i start drawing lines around the perimeter after this the steps are easy after you get that ball starting forget about it all you gotta do is just draw lines around the perimeter of the star just basically follow the same lines in the perimeter of the star and making them lines as sharp when i mean as sharp you want to make them as sharp as possible and look at this look Look how I'm coming. I'm focused. I'm focused. We in that game. And listen, I'm not going to lie right here. I think in the middle, not in the middle, inside the stars right here was kind of a little difficult. So I kind of had to like, like kind of eyeball it and see how would it look when it was bored. So I kind of like bored it out and made it look good somehow. We made it look good somehow. But that's, that's the only difficult part of it. Everything else, forget about it. It's easy. The more lines you draw in the star, listen, the easiest is gonna become and the hard and, and the hardest is gonna look. I'm telling you, you ever made something, you ever made something that was easy but it looks hard and it looks official? That's this right here. Look at this, man. The more draw, the more lines I'm drawing, it looks like the, the stars are just popping out even more. This, this is crazy, yo. Yo, but obviously I made this design what in like 10 minutes? The video's a little sped up. The video's a little sped up, but I kind of drew, I like, I wait, this is not the best one I have done, but this is the one I have right now for the, for the camera. And look how, look how, look how 3D that's looking. You could keep drawing more lines and more lines, but I think I stopped after this one because I didn't want to draw his head for the lines. But yo, this is, this one, this one is it right here. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, this design game, I'm not in the design game, because i seen people draw faces. I'm like, what? I'm like, yeah, there's people that take this out of the whole league. But if y'all want to see more design tutorials, let me know. We coming with the best haircut tutorials coming out soon, my guys. And after this, look at this. The design is done. I'm not going to keep drawing more lines because like how I said, I don't want to draw his head full of designs. I'm going to knock down some bulk with the one. So make sure all the hair is even on the design. And now I'm coming in with the blade. You know when you're coming in with that blade, everything just crispy. I'm doing a dry shave too, so I can see everything I'm doing. I don't really like my hair because what? Well, what? Pause. I don't really like my my lines like what? I like seeing that little ash, that little ash on the designs. You see those little white lines that your barber be leaving you? That's what I like seeing. I like seeing that sharp, crispy look. Oh, the camera got a little out of focus. Here we go. We're going right back to it. And you want to hit every angle with that blade, man. Every single angle. And here we go. Yo, next step is going to do the fade. I'm a, If y'all want to see a more in-depth fade tutorial, let me know. But for right now, I'm going to speed up my little fade process. And I'm going to talk to it real quick. Here I go with the baby list. 
and I'm hitting him with the zero line. And after you hit it with the zero line, I'm coming in with the masters. You know the masters is it. You're gonna hit it with the blade open, and that's the blade open is a one guard. After you hit it with the blade open, you wanna knock it down right now. You're gonna see me knock it down to the half. And then from the half, I'm gonna hit it with the zero and erase that ball line. You see how quick was that? One, two, three. That's my trick. And then from here, we're gonna hit it with the one guard open. We're gonna knock that bulk down. Then we're gonna close the blade, erase that bottom line. Like how I said, I'm not gonna talk too, f I'm gonna talk a little fast in this video. It's not really a face to it's, it's showing you more of the design. And then we're gonna hit it with the half guard, a little open. And now we're gonna hit it with the two guard. That two guard, we're gonna knock all the extra hairs down. He wanna get dread, so obviously there's an ending point to where you wanna fade. But I love this two guard right here because it gives it like the little round effect, which it kind of knocks down the bulk, which it doesn't leave you aligned. And now here we're going back with the one guard open, and we're gonna we're gonna erase those little lines or the little detail lines that you probably won't see. But you want to make sure you got every little line out of there. That's what makes you a good barber and the best barber, man. And yo, my Instagram. And, well, basically, my barbershop, I'm going to leave it right in the description. If you want to contact me or through Instagram, let me know. But yo, you, have a, you know what's the most important thing of a haircut? It's a shape up. The fade color crazy. But that shape up line looking A1, forget about it. The best is it's just it's just ridiculous. It just makes the whole haircut look crazy, a hundred times better. And you may say I pushed his hairline back a little bit, but I didn't. It just that his forehead's really small. So if I was to make it, if I was to make it right on the line where the hair grows, he just looked like he's gonna have a, a box head. So now here we go. We're gonna add some color enhancements. I did add color enhancements to the star, but that's yo right here, man. The star popping, man. Everything popping, haircut popping, but yo, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button for your boy. And look at this fire haircut tutorial, man. Subscribe for your boy, man. Contact me on Instagram if you want to cut from the best on the east side, tri-state, New Jersey, New York, wherever you at, man. I'm here. I'm available. Text me, man. Anyways, man, been your boy, and I'm out of here. Let go! I'm a new soul, I came to this trade world.